Have you ever wondered if ancient myths might be more than just stories? What if the ten avatars of Vishnu, the Dashavatar, are actually a symbolic timeline showing the evolution of life, consciousness and technology? From fish swimming in the ocean to futuristic AI warriors, this ancient Hindu narrative might just predict the journey of humanity itself. Let's dive in. Dashavatar means ten avatars. These are the ten major incarnations of Lord Vishnu, appearing to restore cosmic order. Here's a quick rundown. Matsya, the fish. Kurma, the turtle. Varaha, the boar. Narasimha, the half-man, half-lion. Vimana, the dwarf. Parashurama, the axe-wielding warrior. Rama, the ideal king. Krishna, the divine statesman. Buddha, the enlightened one and Kalki, the future warrior who will end the current age. Now, let's explore what each of these avatars might symbolize in today's world. First up, Matsya, the fish. Matsya saved the sacred texts from a great flood. This avatar symbolizes life's aquatic origins, how life began in water millions of years ago. Next, Kerma, the turtle, who helped churn the cosmic ocean. Kerma represents stability and the move of life from water to land early amphibians and reptiles. Varaha, the boar, lifted the earth from cosmic waters. This represents the rise of mammals, leading to humans dominating the planet. Then Narasimha, half man, half lion. This avatar symbolizes the evolutionary leap to humanoid species, combining primal instincts with growing intellect. Vamana, the dwarf who measured the universe in three steps, stands for early humans expanding their awareness and exploring new frontiers. Parashurama, the axe-wielding warrior, symbolizes humanity's mastery over tools and the start of technological revolutions. Rama, the ideal king and warrior, represents the establishment of social order, ethics and justice. Krishna, the divine statesman, embodies philosophy, diplomacy, culture and science. The golden age of human civilization, Buddha, the Enlightened One, symbolizes spiritual awakening, compassion, and mental health. Finally, Kalki, the future avatar yet to come, often seen riding a white horse, will end the current dark age and bring renewal. Many interpret Kalki as a metaphor for AI, transhumanism, or humanity's next evolutionary leap. When we look at the sequence of avatars, it closely mirrors biological evolution, from aquatic life to amphibians, to mammals, to humans, and beyond. Scholars like Bal Gangadhar Tilak have suggested this connection, showing how Hindu mythology might encode ancient scientific knowledge. Kalki as the future avatar is especially fascinating. Imagine a world where humans merge with AI or become cyborgs. Kalki could symbolize this transformation, an end to the old age and the birth of a new era powered by technology and higher consciousness. So, is the Dashavatar just myth? Or is it a timeless story of evolution, consciousness, and humanity's future? Which avatar speaks to you the most? Let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed this journey through myth and science, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more.